Hello everyone. So today I'm going to show you what are soft 404 errors and how we can fix them. You can see I have this error soft 404 on my website and five pages are facing this issue. And it is really important to understand this is soft 404. An error not found 404 is different error. This sounds very similar soft 404 and not found 404. But they're different errors. Let me show you with some examples and you will understand what are soft 404 errors and why they're different from not found 404 errors. Okay, so if I click on this soft 404 error, you can see I have five pages here. And all these pages are showing soft 404 error. Let's take example of this one. If I just click on this link, which will open this in new tab, then you can see we reach to this page. This page is a product page for this product FRAG 176191. It can be anything else. For example, it can be a car page or a blog post or anything. And you can see no products were found matching your selection. So what happens in case of soft 404 error? The page is a real page, but it has no content. Very, very minimum content on the page. So Google says, okay, you have this page, but when somebody comes on this page, they found nothing. So the content of page is not found, but page exists. That's why Search Console is marking this page as soft 404 instead of page not found. And you just open your page which is facing soft 404 error, right click on the page and click on inspect. And then if you go to network tab, and then if you reload the page, you can see here we are getting status 200, which means the page is okay. But because there's no content on the page, that's why Google is marking this page as soft 404 error. So page exists, but there's no content on the page. That's why Google is saying it is soft 404 error. Let me show you another example. So this is a page which says product no longer available. If I open this page, then you can see this is the page which says only product no longer available. We are sorry, but the product you are looking for is no longer available. Same thing is happening in this page. If I right click and go to inspect and then go to network tab, then I refresh. You can see it's also giving 200 status, which means page exists. But Google is saying to us, if you have a page which exists on the website but has no content, then they're gonna mark it as soft 404 error. So overall, you need to understand soft 404 error means your page exists on your website but has no content on it. And they can one more reason. What that can reason be, if you go back to the Search Console report and if you click here on inspect, and then you need to click on test live URL. And then you see this is the live state of the page. URL is available to Google, but I have to click on view tested page. And then you can see here, if you go to screenshot, you can see here nothing is showing up here, which means the content of the page is not visible to Google. So Google is saying, okay, your page exists, but Google bots cannot read the content on your page. So that's another reason. And this happened because of some JavaScript or CSS is blocking to render this page to Google. So these were two major reasons. Let me explain how you can fix this issue. And guys, there's one more reason which I'm going to explain at the end of this video, which is not very common, but that can also exist. So don't just skip the video after watching the fix of these two possible reasons. Make sure you watch until the end. Okay, so what you need to do is the page facing this issue, you need to add the content on the page. And that content should be relevant to that page. For example, there's a product page. Make sure you add some content to the page. If you will not add the content of the page, it will show 404 error. So that's the first solution. Second solution will be check for errors on the page. For example, if you right click on a page and you click on inspect element, and then if you go to console, you can see I have multiple errors here. They're not really serious error on my website, but you can find many errors on your website. So you need to fix those errors. This video is going to be a really long video. If I try to explain how you can fix JS error and CS errors, because these errors can be totally different on every website. There's no similar errors on every website which are causing this kind of page render blocking. So check here for errors and you can fix those issues. Now let me show you one more example of soft 404 errors. You can see on this website, I have 721 soft 404 errors. If I click on soft 404 and then I scroll the page, you can see there's so many errors here. And if you look at the URL, it doesn't make any sense. These are not real page on the website. This seems this website is hacked because there's virus and malware on the website. That's why Google is marking all these imaginary URLs as soft 404 errors. So second reason can be your website is hacked. If you want to check your website hacked or not, you can use WordFence and anti-malware plugin in your website and make sure you have no virus on your website. I created a complete video about those plugins. So check the description of this video to get rid of all kind of malwares and viruses from your website. I hope you like this video. Please don't forget to smash the like button and subscribe to my channel. And please share this video with somebody. And guys, I already created many videos on Google Search Console errors and how you can fix them. If you want to fix those errors on your website, check this small place on screen that will really help you to increase your website SEO.